All right. Welcome back. I figured I'd kick this thing off. Let's head back to the swamp house now that I can do that. I realized a fatal flaw in between episodes. I took a short break in recording to make sure I'm not used to doing this much talking. I forgot I really need bugs. I still don't know what caught bottle content will give me bugs. It can be something as stupid as the magic mushroom, but I'm gonna then assume that, uh... Pretty useless stuff. And the sculpture list with the... Yeah. Point being, I don't think there's gonna be much point to getting the soil sculpture list. Which isn't a problem with the other swamp house, only this one. So I won't be hearing him t Oh, that's right. I was like, how do I have seven? I forgot, I can technically cure him because I don't know a hundred percent. Alright. Let's get all the recovery hearts because I know there's going to be quite a bit of duplicates. Alright. But just to clear my conscience and grab everything I can. Recovery heart. Oops. Recovery heart. Can't get the soil. Can get this. At least I'm not coming here on one or two hearts now. So if I slip up and do get hit, it's not a big deal. Don't need a bomb. This also be a good reminder for if I did happen to miss anything. Yeah, like this one. Normally, you don't have to hookshot when you come here. And I don't think I've gotten the sculpture like any other way. Is it required? Had your bottle filled with milk. Okay. Not a new bottle. I got re-excited again for a moment. Red rupee. I wonder why that one wasn't a recovery heart. Did I miss him last time? Oh, well. See, by the sound of it, there's still a couple sculptures left because I know there's one here, there's one in the soil, and there's one behind the torch. I've already gotten these ones. Ah! Good to know I can infinitely just get the razor sword if it does happen to disappear. That's actually useful knowledge, and I would be willing to use my sword a little more now. Maybe it's the same reason that 20 rupees was 20 rupees again. Maybe it just doesn't change. Alright. So the big difference now is I also have the Deku Mask, so I'm not limited anymore. Ooh, Pictobox. Now I can freeze my computer trying to take a simple picture through an emulator. Let's see, which means I can take a picture of Tingle give to his dad. And then the pictograph contest, I believe I need to take a picture of the Deku Scrub King. I believe. Alright. I'm not going to bother getting these ones again. I know I've gotten them already. This one, however, I didn't get. Oh, come on. Really? Oh! I can go into the Lost Woods now. I can do the archery. Actually, I'm not sure if I can do the archery until I clear Woodfall Temple, technically. We'll find out. Alright, so there's that. Alright, Rupee. Woo! All right, come on. Really? Thank you. Hey, legitimate swamp sculptula. All right. Eighth one. See why this is so much easier with a hookshot. How many beans are there? 
I thought there was only like one bean. Oh, yeah, probably one in here. Yeah. Compass to Stone Tower Temple. Oh. Realize my maps disappeared. I'll have to go back and check and see what maps or compasses I've had. It's not a big deal for this episode because I've only been inside Snowhead Temple and didn't have much going on there. Ah, there it is. Outside of the soil. That This is the one I was missing. Come on, money's actually useful. Alright. I believe in this one I only need a thousand rupees for the banker. I can still go with an adult wallet. That would be pretty nice. All right, Swamp Sculptula, Stone Tower Fairy. There we go. This is the room I was hoping to get more than just a basic items. Well, I got the pictograph, I guess. It's just one more thing I can do. All right, more health. There's still, like, six heart containers. I wonder why I haven't got any. Alright, was bound to get repeats. Now then. Yeah, there you are. Hey, the bomber's notebook. Now he won't yell at me when I go to get the key. I think I will get the key just to get one closer through the Snowhead Temple. Also because I'm somewhat running out of stuff to do at this point. It's almost the third day, which means I can finish off the playground, too. Okay, this room's done. The other room, I know I finished. Ah, uh, I know it. I probably missed a really easy one. Alright, let's go back through here real quick. Where are you hiding? I forgot. Because the Sculptulas don't make noise if they're in a soil pot, so there's still a loose Sculptula somewhere. I'm probably already gotten, just for forgotten. If it would, it'd be on this side, because I didn't have access to the side before. Or, no, I guess it is making noise, and I'm just a liar. Yeah. A sculpture, a sculpture, and a sculpture, and a sculpture. Yeah, the noise from my headphones is most certainly coming from that soy patch. Alright. I got a pictograph box. I guess I will go take a picture of the Deku King and then Tingle while I'm already here. Then I have to make sure to not forget to do the deck describe third cycle. Alright, change up. I still don't have water either. It's kind of annoying. Yeah, look at him dancing. Alright. I'm gonna do a save state here, because Pictograph has been known to crash RetroArch, and I don't want to lose this progress. Uh, 
All right, all right. And he very angry. Come on, get me a dancing picture. There we go. All right, did, did it freeze? No, but that's way too close. All right, that should be good. Oh god, that's so bad. You think for an emulator they'd be able to Oops. <laughs> how how do Deckers lift a giant gore on out? That's always been a good question to ask. Alright, realize I could probably save some damage and just Deku hop my way over. Ooh, I can do the Lost Woods, rescue her. Okay, I got a couple things left I can do here. As long as I live. Alright, still don't have a deed for you, sorry. Uh, only for humans. Let me transform in front of your face. Pictograph. Alright, big prize. Well, you know how I was just saying I can't do the, uh... Snowhead Temple? I think we can get quite far in the Snowhead Temple now. So... I might have to take a break in between episodes to figure out what keys I have and haven't gotten. But I guess real quick, let's do the rest, because I can do the temple afterwards. But it's good to know I'm not totally out of stuff to do. Let's take a picture of Tingle. Or, I already submitted the pictograph contest? I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm going to have to take a picture of Tingle another time. Darn. Darn. Alright, but I can still Lost Woods. The only path I haven't memorized is Day 3, so I will actually have to follow the monkey around. But at the least, I do have a red potion for her. And then I can get the boat to her. Could I do the archery or... Oh. I have questions. I don't want to miss the deck of scrub playground by doing all these side quests first. Best to just slow down time again. Let's see, I'm still missing five songs, it looks like. No heart containers. Oh, I've had Deku Nuts before. I got magic beans. I already lost the monkey, damn it. Alright, I screwed. I screwed up and then I unscrewed up. Ow. Hello there. Do you care for a red potion? I will help you. One thing I like about Majora's Mask compared to Ocarina is that you get this screen where you can physically hand them the item. Not Karina, I've accidentally dumped whatever potion I have. Like in Jabba Jabu, I was just a little bit out of range. So I had to go and get the fish again and everything. Alright. What you gonna give me? Alright, if I keep going straight, I'll eventually leave. But never... Oh, come on. Yes, I have strange powers. As I transform and beat you. Whee! I'm so glad they made this water not deep enough for Goron to drown.
Give me something good. And... Ugh, oh, map to Bramani Ranch. So I don't think I have a place to mark the map, but I mean, it's in my start screen, so it doesn't matter. Well, that would have been nice for the ghosts. able to do the archery. Uh, this is it a cruise or is it archery? I'll pay and find out. Like I said, I'm a kid. Yeah, alright. Alright. So next up, let's go do the Deku Playground. But maybe this will give me something good. Watch, if this gives me a Snowhead Temple Key, I'm going to be really pressed for time. But if it gave me the Great Fairy Mask, ooh, that'll be sweet. Alright. Gotta wait, gotta wait, gotta wait, gotta wait. Alright. And... Plop. This is probably the easiest one for me, for some reason. It's probably because I don't have to do so much waiting. So maybe it's not easier as much as it makes me happier. Inside. Pop and wait. Drop. I think this is the longest waiting is this inner square right here. Yep. Now I just grab this blue rupee and I win. What was my time? I wasn't paying attention. 38 seconds. All right. Ugh, bomb shoes. All right. Now they're going to fear me. Man, where would I find the great fairy mask? It could be literally anywhere. All right. I'm just going to... Get some money until it's time for the curiosity shop. So, I'll cut to that. Alright, I'm cutting back to this moment because I just had a thought I wanted to talk about. Maybe I don't need the spring water for as many areas as I would think. This is on day two, it rains, but I can't remember if that rain will grow the beans because then I can get the chest on the stump well actually I can get the chest on the stump now I have the hook shot all right now, once I kill these Dodongos I will get to this chest on the stump all right let's see what we can get here I still want a Pona song too. Alright, another heart. And here I was tricking myself into being excited. Let's see, where am I have? Okay. Alright, another quick cut because I realized I can get this chest in here while I was just gore on rolling around out of boredom. So, we'll see what this is too. Okay, Woodfall Stray Fairy. Alright, back to keep collecting money. It's not quite time for the curiosity shop yet all right it's not time for the curiosity shop yet it's night time and i'm out of money so could just grit magic and far more i'm at about 930 in the shop so i can get the item from that later however what i remembered is i have the hook shot i can grab the chest up here and the one on top maybe this is money who knows all right more health as usual 
won't like say no to it, even though at this point there are better. And this one. Well, it, it's money. I'll go ahead and donate on this one just so you can see exactly how much I have. I just ran around killing Dodongos and shooting enemies with light arrows until I had enough. Because who knows, maybe the thousand one is the wallet upgrade. So I can buy an item from the Deku Scrub. Forty nine? Ugh. Alright, I'll just fast forward. I can get I can get fifty one rupees real quick before Curiosity Shop Man. I have enough money, and it's pretty close to the curiosity shop time at this point. What I forgot to mention is that I also grabbed a uh, green potion, because I forgot it's just sitting there in Clock Town. Now, I might as well try to sell that too, because if I just sell the milk and it's 20, which is something I've already turned in, then this would have been a waste of nothing. Green potion might give me something different. Who knows? But let's donate this and see what our bank reward is. If it's a key... I'm going to be pissed. I don't think it can be a key. But I'm not sure how broken this much randomization is. Survey says... Ah, the cafe mask. That means I can actually start the Anju cafe side quest, or at least see what Anju will give me at midnight in the kitchen. So, that's something. I can start that before I go to Snowhead because I can go to the Stockpot Inn right, pretty much right away. I have to wait till like 8.30, but two and a half hours is nothing comparatively. Alright, 10 o'clock. I apologize for all the cutting and skipping I've been doing too. Did I buy the bomb bag? Whatever. I believe I did already. Now that I'm not too concerned about a fairy, I'll probably buy it again later, now that I have money. Ah, 20 rupees. Alright. And this. Another 20 rupees? Alright. Well, playing the Song of Time will be a good way to end this episode. Next time will be probably me going through Snowhead as much as I can. Still gonna suck without the Great Fairy Mask. But I will also take a small break to do the Anju and Cafe to see what Anju can give me there. And to buy the Bim Bong Bab, just in case I didn't get the fairy. Because usually I try to buy the entire store so I can just make a mental note of, Hey, I'm done with the store. But for now, it's what it is. Till then, I'll see y'all next time.